welcome back. Today we are going to be stuffing my cash envelopes for the fourth week in March, or my fourth week in March, and we'll be seeing how I did in week three with my spending. Not a whole lot happened last week that was out of the ordinary, except I got my stimulus, and so if you missed my last stimulus stuffing, I will link it up above. Check it out. It was really fun <laughs> to stuff. Um, other things that happened this month, not last week, but I paid off my Bank of America credit card, which was really great. And this upcoming week, I have some birthdays, I have friends coming to visit, so I'm definitely going to have a lot of spending, and I should be getting paid my first YouTube paycheck. I will stuff that money in my typical side hustle cash stuffing, so that will probably be a bigger cash stuffing than usual, so that'll be probably my next video, so stick around for that. So the first thing I like to do is go through and just fill in anything new that has hit my account which a few things did. I know my insurance hit and it was more than I expected. Yes, it was $91.15. So I think it didn't decrease as much as I thought it did after changing some settings. So I need to budget more for that moving forward. And then this iCloud bill did hit for $2.99. And I already filled in my take home pay from my side hustle, which was only $40 this week because my Etsy um, sales had really slowed down. But then in week three, I'm trying to think if I put, I didn't put any money towards debt except for my stimulus, um, except for it's still a ton of money. So that was 450 and I cannot wait to add all this up. This is insane. Yeah, absolutely crazy how much I've progress I've made in March. So I did do that and now we can go in and see how I did, um, for my weekly spending, which I also track here, and see how I did here. So, in groceries, let's see, we definitely have stuff left. I don't know what is wrong with me, but I keep not going to the grocery store, so I've just been eating out a lot, and I've been using money for that. So in groceries, we still have 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, and 44. That means we only spent six dollars, right? Yeah, six dollars. Um, I'll show you what I'm gonna do with that. Eating out is empty, so we spent all 20. We spent 20 on flex. Um, we spent nothing on fun or alcohol because we didn't budget. Um, toiletries, we have 10, 20, so we didn't spend any of that. I do need to spend some of that this this weekend though. And then in gas, we did spend a $20 bill. So we have one $20 bill left. So that is still in here. And then my back to bank just has some ones that I need to deposit. So let's see how much we spent. So we only spent $66 this week, which is really just because I'm so busy. And so I've been eating out more and I had like some money on gift cards and things. So that's why like... I was able to not spend so much out of groceries. It wasn't because I wasn't eating, so no worries there. I didn't have any unbudgeted, but then I did have my first city credit card extra payment from my stimulus. Now that I'm done with my Bank of America, I am moving on to this, and we put 450 towards that, which is so awesome. So really exciting there. And typically I would put all of this in my March Madness, but because my friends are coming next week and I do need to stock up on groceries for snacks and stuff for them, and I was going to do that before this video, but I ran out of time. So I'm going to take the $40 and roll it over, but I will put these $4 in March Madness. So this is the March Madness envelope that us budgeters are using to save for the month of March. So for Week three, we did put in $50 in my stimulus, and now we're adding one, two, three, four. So we will add this in here. And let's see how much we've saved so far. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 81, 2, 3. So we have $83 which is really exciting because I thought I was going to have like $4 in here, but I forgot about the stimulus, so I just put some money in there for this. 
So now what we'll do is we'll roll this into next week's money. So for budgeting that out, we had $50 budgeted for groceries and I'm going to add this to it. So we'll have 50, 70, 80, 90. Okay, I forgot everything I budgeted. So we did 20 for eating out, 20 for flex, 40 for fun, 20 for elk, nothing new for toiletries, and we have $20 left for gas. So I guess I'll put 20 here because we still have 20. So available to spend this week, we have 230. So I'm going to add this into my cash for the week and we'll get stuffing. Okay, so we should have 242 plus the $40 rollover, so we should have 282. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 210, 220, 225, 230, 235, 240, 245, 250. So 250. 250, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60. 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70. 71, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 81, and 82. So 282, a lot of ones today. So let's set her up. Today we'll start with my wallet. So in groceries, instead of 50, we are doing 90. So we'll do 50, 70, Hmm, we'll do two tens that I pulled out. So 50, 70, 80, 90 in groceries. And that will be super, super useful for stocking up on some snacks. Eating out is getting 20. So we'll do a 10, a five and five ones. One, two, three. Okay. So now we have 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 and what? 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I don't know what. I don't know. It's fine. It's been a long day. Next is our flex funds, which is getting the same. It's getting 20. Why did I not do this? These ones are going to pop on out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So now we have 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. These ones have been through it. So flex gets its 20 and then fun is getting 40 and I did that in four tens. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40. So that's my fun money for the whole month. I waited until this week to put it in here. And then alcohol is getting 20, which I did in two tens. My ones will cooperate. So 10 and 20 and we have the 20 left in toiletries and the 20 left in gas. So we're good y'all. This is the most my wallet's probably ever been stuffed. So that's really exciting. Now we're moving on to my revolving funds. So some of these aren't, most of these aren't getting stuffed. So I, I'm still going to count them, but adventures has $21. Boyfriend also has 21, so I won't count that one. And it is not getting, no, it is getting $5. I lied. So we have $5 in boyfriends. Now we have 20, 25, 26. I forgot I stuffed that. 26 in boyfriend. Car maintenance is getting eight. So we have five and then three ones. I need to fix this. I just still haven't. I'm so lazy. I'm not lazy. I'm busy. Okay. So car maintenance has 100, 200, 220, 230, 235, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, and 42. 242. Almost at my deductible. Clothing is not getting anything. And it has 50, 60, 75 which is awesome because my boyfriend and I want to go shopping. 
in June. So I'm gonna try and stack this up to a couple hundred dollars. Electronics isn't getting anything, but we have 50, 20, am I okay? Like I just said 50, send help. 20, 35, Lord. I don't know what the heck. And then entertainment is getting 10. Oh good, I can move all these up. Sting. So entertainment has 100, 120, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 210, 215. 1, 2, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2, 10, 15. Okay, 215. I don't know. I think I just... I feel like I did when I had COVID, when I had like COVID brain and I was all foggy. That's how I feel right now. But this... <laughs> Um, envelope will also be what I'm using when my friends are in town. So I'm glad that it is above 200. Fitness and wellness has 20, 40, 50, 65, and it's not getting anything. Gifts is not getting anything, but we've got 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. Giving is getting a dollar per usual. And then giving, we have now 20, 21, 22, 23. Household is not getting anything, and it has 20, 40, 50, 51, and 52. Kristen, that's me. I'm not getting anything, but I have $21 for whatever. Medical has the same $942 it's had forever, so I'm not going to count it. <laughs> Self-care has 21 which is a new category. Not getting anything, although I probably need to start doing that because I have a haircut coming up. Shopping has 20 30 35 40 Nothing. Subscriptions has 25 I know that because I just did my stimulus stuffing not long ago. Vacation has 50, 70, 90, 110, 115, and 120. Volleyball is getting stuffed and it is getting $4. So in volleyball, we have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, and 44. So $44, I'll probably thin this out soon because it has too many ones. Weddings and babies has 20, 40, 45, 50, 51, and 52. Not my weddings and not my babies, but other people's weddings and babies. And then one week ahead isn't getting anything and is fully funded. And so we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 150. And that is it for this binder. Now we have our fixed sinking funds and we are, I am, I'm just going to go ahead and take this out because I'm going to be buying my friend's birthday gift today. So I'm going to pull this out and if I don't use it all, I'll put it back in here and I'll tell y'all in my next video what I'm going to do with that money. But I'm literally doing that right after I film this video. So I'm going to take that out. Mother's Day is getting $3, and I'm pretty sure this will fully fund it. So on Mother's Day, we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. So woohoo, Mother's Day is funded. And we're going to be with my mom because we'll be um, finally having a funeral for my grandmother who passed during COVID time. She didn't die of COVID, but during COVID time. And we are going to do the funeral the day before Mother's Day, so I'll be able to be with her for that. So that will be great. Um, not the funeral, but being with my mom. And my friend's birthday is getting five. So now we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, and 29. That's so annoying. We have one dollar left. Next week, next week. Father's Day isn't getting anything yet, but soon. And my boyfriend's birthday is getting $4. I think that was four. Oh gosh. So we should have 75 if I did that right. So 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, we did it right. 
$75 for Colin's birthday in August. Black Friday is not getting anything, but I did stuff it in my stimulus, so it has 30. And my anniversary fund got started with $20, I believe. Yeah. So that is it for this one. I'll be adding in some new envelopes soon for the like late summer holidays. And now we have Big Blue to finish us off. We're starting with Planner, which gets $4. One, two, three, and four. So inside planner, we now have 20, 40, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 76 dollars in planner. So next week we will fully fund this and we'll be ready to order a new planner. Car tax is getting five dollars. So now in car tax we have 100, 120, 130, 135, and 140. And I think the goal is 170 on this, so 175. So very close on that as well. And then California, my favorite one to stuff. One of my favorite ones to stuff right now is getting 30. And I'm supposed to have another 10. Where did it go? What? Why don't I have it? So I have a 20 and I need two 10. So oh, this is perfect. This was my friend's birthday money. And now we're just going to boop. Bye. Okay, perfect. So now we have $30 for California. And which one has more? I think transportation has more with 375. Yes. So we'll put the 20 in lodging. And with the 20 in lodging, we now have 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 390. So we only need 10 more dollars in lodging. So 390 in lodging. And then in transportation, we have 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 380, and 385. So we need 15 more in here, 10 more in here. So just 25 more dollars and we're fully funded for those two categories for California. So in total for my California trip, we had 884 and we just added 30. So we're at 914. Ooh, we're almost to our first thousand, which means we're more than halfway there. And then my friend's wedding is getting 10. And I know lodging is fully funded. Let's see where Tan is at. Oops, hello. Okay, Tan has 15 and it needs 25. So we'll put the last 10 in here. So now we have 10, 20, 25. And Tan is fully funded. So I'll have to update that tracker. Yay! So now for her wedding, let's see. We have 565 plus 10, so 575, and that doesn't include what I already paid out for my Airbnb, and then flights are already paid for for the bachelorette party, so yay. Ah, no, I always do this. I gotta get new envelopes. And then Christmas is getting our last $3 before we move on to our savings challenge, so $3 in Christmas. So now in Christmas, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, no. Kristen, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, and $97. 97 in Christmas, almost to our first hundred. And that is very exciting. And now we get to go into our savings challenge. For my savings challenge, I just basically put money in a bag that I use to stuff this. That's what this money is. And then I pick a random number between five and 20 and there's more 20s than there are of any other number. And by the end of six months, I, six months? Yes. At the end of six months, I will save $400. So that is the savings challenge I made for myself and that's the one I'm doing. So let's see what number we get this week. Oh, it's folded. Seven, all right. It's pretty low. So we'll do one five and two ones. So we have five, six, seven. 
We'll add this to the numbers I have already drawn. And we'll just stuff her in there and we won't count it. So the envelopes in here for my California trip and this was the $130 I saved in the first two months. And then this stack of cash is what I saved in the um, since the start of March. So we're not gonna count this. It just sits in here and we will count it either at the end of April or May or whenever I feel like it. And then the rest of this money goes back into my bag. And sometimes I like to check in and see how much I have in case I need to stuff it more. But we have 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight. I already forget. My brain today, y'all. I don't know what's happening. 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 61. Okay, I'm fine. 61 will last me a while. So now I'm going to color in my little tracker because I always forget to do that with y'all. And then I feel very bad later. We've gotten the number 7 today. Yay! So let's see, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 weeks left. And we've done 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. No way. Did I just happen to count this on the halfway point? I did. What are the odds, y'all? I literally, what are the odds that I'm halfway done the day that I count just to see where I'm at? That's so weird. But here we are. Okay. So we're halfway done and we've only done one, two, three, four twenties out of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <laughs> ah, so the end of this is gonna be really hard because <laughs> I'm gonna get a million twenties, but that's okay because I have that bag of money. <laughs> um, so it's fine. Okay. Well, that's it for this stuffing. I'll let you know how much of this $30 I spend on my friend's birthday gifts, and I will definitely definitely do a breakdown of my friend's trip when they came to visit. I will walk y'all through all of my spending and we'll talk about that in my next regular income cash stuffing, which won't be until this time next week. So stick around for that. And um, before that video, you will definitely see my side hustle sinking, my side hustle cash stuffing that will hopefully include my first YouTube paycheck. So hope to see y'all there. Please like and subscribe and I'll see y'all next time. Bye. Hey y'all, friendly reminder that the week four March Madness giveaway is going on now. So make sure that you check out the playlist linked up above. You'll need to be publicly subscribed to all those nine channels, like each of the videos, comment hashtag four by four giveaway on all of the videos and uh, a way for us to get in contact with you, either your Instagram or an email address. And you'll be entered to win one of four awesome prizes that consist of an ebook from Budget Treasures, an Etsy gift card, and some free digital downloads, a month's free consulting services with Rochelle, or a $100 cash prize. So the prizes are really great. We would love for y'all to enter. So please check that out. And I'll link also my video up above where I first announced it if you want more information. But the playlist up above will have all of our videos. And so you can just go through and like and comment on all of them all at once in one sitting and you'll be entered to win. So remember to do that. And I'm wishing y'all the best of luck.